Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here with Donatello himself, Jeremy Howard. How are you doing today? I'm awesome. How are you doing? I am doing fantastic. I didn't think I'd get such a wonderful opportunity. <laughs> I didn't either. <laughs> here we are, Joey. Together, hanging out. Oh, yes, definitely. So tell us, how did you get into acting? When did you know that this is what you wanted to pursue? Oh, gosh. Uh, I got into acting pretty young. I think I did a, a Denny's commercial uh, at six. And uh, after high school, I didn't really know what else to do and uh, just kind of it, I, I kind of stumbled into it and loved it so much I just kind of kept going and uh, here we are today oh excellent so you've been doing all this other work especially surrounding uh, CGI like uh, yes, CGI. I'm just looking I'm just looking at this photo right, right here right. I'm sorry I just love this I always find the mi the most minor roles it's just this dude in men in black and Tommy Lee Jones is just like no smoking what was it like working with such um, wonderful actors over the years Oh, it's been amazing. I mean, I've been very, very lucky uh, to be with some great talent, and uh, it's, what can I say, it's a lot of fun. A lot of oh, fun. Definitely. So now, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, let me put this back. That's a big deal, of course, but of course they're trying to hire, I notice, especially for the Ninja Turtles over the movies, relatively unknown talent, uh, rather, like people you wouldn't expect. Well, of course, John Knoxville was Leonardo, but other than that. So how did that go? Did they ask you to play Leonardo, like, or did you have to audition? I don't know how casting for big name movies works. Right, I know, I, I definitely had to audition. Uh, just kind of a nor the normal acting way uh, for any project. It wasn't like, you know, we need people to be able to do you know, CG, motion capture, anything like that. It was just like they wanted actors to be able to interact any old way. And I think they went with una unknowns because these guys have such big personalities to begin with. You don't want it to be uh, sort of tainted with uh, personal baggage that, say, a movie star would bring. And I think that's where they were coming from from this. And uh, it worked out, obviously, in my favor and the other three guys because, you know, we hadn't really done anything this big. And uh, it's been amazing just to be a part of that turtle world, but uh, yeah, it's, it's it's been a blast. Now that mocap suit, though, yes. ma massive thing. Yes. How was it like working in that? It actually wasn't too bad because everything's foam. That's amazing. So it's you know everything weighs half a pound, so it's not. And every, you know you're wearing a wetsuit with markers on it and a shell that's uh, super light. So. Bulletproof. Too. Bulletproof <laughs> shell, and you can also sleep on it in between takes because it's really soft. Oh, amazing! Uh, that yeah. must feel really great. And, uh, of course, the turtles were the best part of the movie. That was well, excellent, you. yes. And so the sequel has been confirmed to the weekend of. What do you hope to see, hopefully? I assume they haven't told you much. I, I have seen uh, a good layout of what it's going to be. Uh, I'm excited because, you know what they really have now? They have, they have the bones of what this new take on the turtles is going to be. It took them a while to find the tone of that first one. And with this second one, they go in with a script that is whole, ready to go. It's not like they need to change things and more move things around, which they had to do for this first one, because originally it was like, okay, we're going to make a really dark Batman, you know, begins type of a movie. But, you know, this is a family film. It's a funny film. Kids love it. Really had to kind of gear that more towards family. So now they know that. They know what they need. They want humor in there. And they really kind of know how to sit down and write the second one, the third one, you know, however more they're able, we're able to do. But uh, I think this movie is going to be a lot more, um, even more enjoyable than the first one, a lot funnier, kind of a tighter film. And uh, I think fans will be surprised. That it's, it's always great when you see a film that's even better the second time. So I'm looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to it too. You know what I'm looking forward to most? What? More turtles. More turtles, yeah. and you will get that. A lot more turtles in the second one. More dubstep, too, please. That was amazing. <laughs> All right, so this has been an interview with the actor slash Donatello, Jeremy Howard. Jo check out www.saccon.com for more details, and be sure we'll see you at SAC Anime and SACCon. Goodbye.